previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Hey, dickhead! Get the fuck out of here! Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel's a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe, if one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? That was my dad. Ah! And that woman was definitely not my mom. Siemieszko, witam was w pierwszym odcinku z drugiego epizodu The Life is Strange Before the Storm Teraz się zamknijmy, bo już dzieje się dalsza część historii Miss Price How good of you to join us. <laughs> I'm so sorry we're late. My, my shift ran late at the diner and then... Just... Sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with it. <laughs> Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon a foundation of mutual respect meant to foster an environment conducive to education and enrichment. When that respect okay. was violated... Reality check time. Yesterday did actually happen. I ditched school with Rachel Amber, and then Rachel really did start that fire. And that was after we actually agreed to run away from here. <laughs> right? Are you paying attention to me, Chloe? Um... What? <laughs> the Miss Price, the last time we met, an agreement was brokered. Do you recall what that was? Uh, raczej sobie nie chcę przerąbać dalej, tym bardziej, że Rachel również nic nie mówi, więc... No. Let me refresh your memory. We agreed that you would rededicate yourself to becoming an exemplary Blackwell citizen. We did. <laughs> In the event that you were unable or unwilling to do so, we also agreed that it would become pertinent to reassess your future status at the Academy. Despite all this, you engaged in the following actions yesterday. Insubordinate language. Attempting to sabotage the academic goals of one of our top students, Victoria Chase. Ah, Victoria. <laughs> oh. Academic goals like doing her own homework? Because I thought Blackwell had a zero tolerance policy on plagiarism. Excellent suggestion. Stricter punishment for students who violate Blackwell's code of conduct is next on our agenda. For her plagiarism, Miss Chase might have been suspended. Chloe, you tried to get someone suspended? <laughs> might have. If Mr. Prescott, Nathan Prescott, hadn't spoken to me on Victoria's behalf, and we have witnesses saying Miss Price was also involved in a bullying incident with the same Mr. Prescott. <sighs> If involved means not sticking out my neck for Blackwell's richest ass child, I didn't realize that was a crime. Your lack of awareness does not absolve you of anything, Miss Price. Oh, Chloe. Bullying? Maybe you should be talking to Drew instead of me. You know, the guy who actually did what you're accusing me of. Mr. North's situation requires sensitivity. It will be handled separately. 
Ale ja nic nie zrobiłem. Um, Reach your mom. Come wells. Raczej nie chcę tutaj pogarszać sytuacji do wobec prezydentego dyrektora, więc. Mom, you know this is all bullshit. Right? Chloe, now is not the time. <laughs> And yet, even with your prodigious disciplinary record, Miss Price, we needn't discuss any of it. We needn't? No, because you severed your relationship with Blackwell the minute you left school grounds without permission. What does that mean? It means... You forced my hand. This is a consequence of your actions, Chloe. I have no choice I but to... I made her do it. What? 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 Yesterday was all me. My idea. I was having a bad day. I needed to blow off some steam, and I took it too far. Chloe tried to talk me out of it. I've been down that road, she told me. You're better than this. But I wouldn't listen. See, Chloe was afraid I'd get in trouble or hurt, so she came with me. But only to keep me safe. I'm just sorry you got caught up in it, Chloe. That you allowed me to drag you down to my level. Can you forgive me? Um, idziemy w tok jej lania wody. Raczej tak. Yeah, sure. We're cool. Thank you. I'll make it up to you. I promise. Chloe, is this true? It's true. Totally not true. She really is an amazing actress. Miss Price? Fine, yes. It was her idea. But it's not like she kidnapped me. We were in it together. Miss Amber, based on what you've just told me, I have grounds to punish you. Are you sure what you've told me is the truth? Yes. This can't be the full story, Rachel. Ray! Just to be clear, Miss Amber, you're sure Chloe Price didn't coerce you or... Trick her? Yes, I'm sure. Oh, thank God. Mrs. Price, this revelation may color the situation some, but it in no way absolves your daughter. I understand, Mr. Wells. There is no doubt that Chloe's behavior must improve. But given what we've just learned about the negative influence she was under, I hope you will allow her just one more chance. Miss Amber, I am as surprised as I am disappointed in you. I understand. This being your first infraction in no way reduces its severity. Still, we will not be suspending you at this time. But you have squandered our trust. You will no longer be my administrative assistant first period. Ouch. And you will no longer be involved in Blackwell's performance of the Tempest. Oh, nie. No. Nie zostanie aktorką. But the performance is tonight. For someone so aware of our school calendar, Miss Price, I would expect fewer absences on your record. Ray, she loves that show. Since this is her first infraction, don't Mr. you think, Amber, uh... I don't tell you how to run the district attorney's office. Please don't tell me how to run my school. There's a reason we have understudies for all circumstances, accidental and deliberate. I'm sure your understudy. Victoria Chase. Uh -huh. How fitting. Yes, I'm sure Victoria Chase will do fine. Serio? That is such... What was that, Miss Price? Chloe is upset for her friend, but we are both grateful that she is not going to be unduly blamed for what happened. There is plenty of blame to go around. Chloe's future at Blackwell will be discussed next, unless you had something to add first, Miss Price. Wiedziałem, że kluczowe, ale... Weź na siebie winę. Albo dalej kontynuuj sytuację na Rachel. 
Ryzykujemy? Czy idziemy na łatwiznę? Ryzykujemy! No way is Rachel missing the play for me. But thanks to her acting skills, I'll have to go down in flames if I want to fix this. Get your head out of your ass, Chloe. To jest ten film najciekawsze. Yesterday was a little misunderstanding. Miss Amber has accepted her responsibility. Don't you have the slightest idea? Yes, there's a point. Yes, there's a point. You don't wake up one morning and decide to be an outlaw. You need priors. You need training. Rachel confessed. Are you calling her a liar? I guess she can act. You should confess. Wells. Yes. She confessed to falling for her crap. Yes, there's a point. I don't blame you though. She's one hell of an actress. You don't have to do this. It's okay. Really. Uh. How about you? Yes, it's booked. Yes, it's booked. You don't see me claiming I did my homework, do you? Because that's your stupid thing. Chloe, you see them. You see them. Apologize this instant. Uh. Fine. I shouldn't have pulled Rachel out of class. If I'd known she couldn't handle it, I would have gone it alone. Jedno jednego. W tej chwili jedna odpowiedź. Why speak up, Miss Price? Your words do not exonerate Rachel, but they do further implicate you. Why? Zwycięstwo. The truth, for once. Zwycięstwo. Fuck you. Really around here. Ale ryzyko, wow! Everybody lies. I've heard enough. Rachel, you were clearly trying to cover for your classmate. I appreciate the motive, but I appreciate honesty more. Is that understood? Yes, sir. You will not be removed from the place. Yes! Yes! Was that so hard? Thank you. And Miss Price, I came into today's meeting planning to suspend you for the rest of the school year with a chance for reinstatement in the fall and now you are expelled what no i will have skip matthews escort you to clean out your locker you may wait outside my office mnie ze szkoły ale pomogłem Rachel. that is all good day mrs price mr and mrs amber Ray. Come on, Chloe. Ciekawe, jak to wpłynie teraz na naszą historię. Tego jestem ciekaw. I'm sorry. Nothing to be sorry about. Meet me at the junkyard later? You bet. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself. I'm Joyce. Mrs. Price. I'm Rose. This is James. I'm sorry we had to meet like this. No, I'm sorry. I'm sure for you this is an unusual circumstance. We really should be going. Nice to meet you. Aha, myślałem, że w jakiś sposób pomogą do Kalipa, ale będzie wkurzona. Mom, I'll see you in the parking lot. Hey, Chloe. I'm supposed to walk you out. Just you and me, a skip. You know I was supposed to have today off, right? Sorry that my totally fair and impartial hearing inconvenienced you, man. Aha, on pomaga nam wywalić wszystko. Except my secret stash. Might as well grab my emergency joint while I'm here. Eee, szczerze, po co mam przyglądać rzeczy, które mam w szafce, które za chwilę wyciągnę? Nie mam pojęcia, ale nie będzie. Maybe Kim was the class I hated the least. Okay. <laughs> Spoko.
Pamiątka zapisana. Pamiątka ze względu na to, że były tutaj inne osoby i tu zapisywały się, by zaraz po odejściu ze szkoły prawdopodobnie. Expelled. It's starting to feel real. W każdym roku ktoś został wywalony z tej szafki i ze szkoły. Trusty keeper of my graffiti pens. You've served love how every time someone tells me how much potential I have, it's right before saying how I'm wasting it all. <laughs> to stop, Pawe. Do kosza. Szybko pójdzie, widzę czyszczenie tego. E, kot? Dad got Bongo from the rescue shelter. Then he got run over by a car. Moral of the story, no one's ever really rescued. Mhm. Mm Ale płota się pamiątka, więc możemy wziąć. Coś z edukacji byśmy tutaj wzięli, czy też nie? Geometria do kosza. <laughs> E, angielski do kosza. Fajki możemy wziąć. Ale nie można, widzę. Można tu coś wziąć prócz tego zdjęcia. Previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Hey! Dickhead! Get the fuck out of here! Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other. But you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel is a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day I'm just out of here. Let me know if you need Previously on Life is Strange Before the Storm. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. I'm gonna teach this little punk some manners. Hey, dickhead! Get the fuck out of here! Between your grades and your disregard for my rules, I see you slipping. I'm worried. We don't have to like each other, but you will respect me. Hello, Black Hell. Chloe, do something! Hey, do you know if Rachel is a gamer? How would you like to join me on a little field trip? Don't be surprised, Chloe. If one day I'm just out of here, let me know if you need an accomplice. Damn, they are really going at it. You remember that guy that we saw under this tree with that woman? That was my dad. <coughs> And that woman was definitely not my mom. Siemieszko, witam was w pierwszym odcinku z drugiego epizodu The Life is Strange Before the Storm Teraz się zamknijmy, bo już dzieje się dalsza część historii Miss Price How good of you to join us. <laughs> I'm so sorry we're late. My my shift ran late at the diner and then just sorry. Let us proceed. One of you here is new to the Blackwell disciplinary process. And the other is all too familiar with <laughs> Blackwell's code of conduct is built upon